Now, the most dramatic moment of all, casting. The molten aluminum is transferred from the furnace to the casting station. It must stay pure, free from contaminants and oxidation. For that reason, it is poured from the bottom of the mold, not the top. This bottom fill method prevents the molten metal from splashing and mixing with air, which could form oxide impurities. As the aluminum flows into the sand mold, it races through a network of gates and channels, filling every void and corner with molten light. In just a few moments, the glowing metal takes the form of a solid engine block. Once the metal cools and hardens, the mold is unlocked and removed. What emerges is a rough but recognizable block, the foundation of an engine. Workers carefully lift the fresh casting from its mold. The air is filled with the hiss of cooling metal and the crackle of sand breaking free. The cast block still carries remnants of its sandy shell, but beneath lies a single, continuous piece of aluminum, precisely shaped and incredibly strong. 